when Northwest College first opened its doors in 1966. Its future looked uncertain. Marcia first inherited the college from her mother, who had just purchased the land and begun construction on the school when she passed away. Marcia was left with a partially completed building and nearly $150,000 in debt. Though she had long dreamed of becoming a medical missionary, Marcia fulfilled her mother's vision for the college and set out to make it a reality. In a 1980 interview with McCall's Magazine, she shared, I was so determined to make this thing work that I didn't stop to ask, is this realistic? I just thought I could do it. Northwest College opened with two classes and 43 students, all of whom were women. Combining a women-centric school with a healthcare curriculum marked a radical shift in education in Southern California at the time. By 1976, Northwest College had grown to more than 1,000 students at two campuses, the original West Covina location, along with a new campus in Pomona. As she learned about needs in her community, Marcia developed programs to meet those needs, including a new pharmacy technician program, which was the first of its kind in the nation. As Northwest College continued to flourish, Marcia remained committed to upholding the quality of education offered at Northwest. Her ongoing advocacy for quality vocational education also landed Marsha roles as spokesperson for the National Association of Trade and Technical Schools and president of the California Association of Private Postsecondary Schools, making her the first woman elected to that post in the organization's history. In a 1981 interview with the Tribune, Marsha explained that her home life as a child made her cherish close family relationships. Although she had many demands on her time, Marsha First was fiercely committed to her role as a wife and mother to her four children. I can remember as a young man, my mom coming home from the college in a suit and heels and directing one of us to run off and get her an apron so she could prepare dinner. There we stood in the kitchen, watching mom prepare our family's dinner in her business attire. In addition to caring for her family, Marcia managed to continue to grow and expand Northwest College, adding a Pasadena campus in 1980 and a Glendale campus in 1982. In 2004, NWC launched a campus in Riverside as well, adding many programs previously unavailable to its students. In 1992, Mitchell joined the college and worked alongside his mother to become her successor to continue her legacy. He became the president of the college in 2012, and under Mitchell's leadership, many new programs and campuses have been added. Northwest College has grown to be part of a system of allied health schools, known as Success Education Colleges, which includes Glendale Career College, Nevada Career Institute, Marsha Burr School of Nursing, as well as Northwest College. This college system spans multiple states and serves thousands of students as they train for careers in the healthcare field. Many years ago, Mitchell's wife Lisa joined SEC to support Mitchell as the college has continued to experience quality growth. Mitchell also wanted to continue his mother's legacy by forming what is named the First Family Foundation. This foundation has its own unique story, a story that starts with a giraffe. Through the success of Success Education Colleges, the foundation is a philanthropic organization committed to opening the doors of education to all students of life. The mission of the foundation is to provide an education for those who cannot afford it and to support organizations that are located in the service delivery areas of the college's campuses. And we believe that education is the first step to transforming a life. Today, Marsha First Legacy lives on it lives in the hearts of the staff and instructors she worked with at the college and in the hearts of the thousands of students who have come through its doors since 1966. It also lives on through the First Family Foundation. It's a legacy that says, you too can be a pioneer. You too can change the world around you. A legacy of success.